I'm going to be making some cheddar cheese and caraway sable. Now these are really, really tasty little cheese biscuits, but they're incredibly easy to make. And I'm going to start off with some of our 1833 reserved cheddar. And uh, when you've got such a simple recipe, you need a really, really well-flavoured cheddar to, uh, to give it lots of character. So we need 100 grams or three and a half ounces of our cheddar. And that's just going into a food processor. To keep things simple, we've got the same quantity of plain flour. So 100 grams, three and a half ounces. And the same quantity again of softened butter. And then all we do is blitz it up into a soft dough. So it couldn't be easier. Next, we just need to get it onto a piece of cling film and just start shaping that into a cylinder. So once you've got the dough onto the cling film, you can then use the film to start shaping the dough into a cylinder. So just keep rolling that over in the cling film into a cylinder. And then twist the ends in opposite directions, like a sweetie, to give a really nice tight cylindrical shape. And that just goes into the fridge now to chill. You could also put it into the freezer and then just leave it there until you need it. So it's a really great standby recipe. Once the mixture's had at least an hour in the fridge, just to firm up, you can unwrap it and then just cut it into really, really thin slices. Now, the thing I love about this recipe is that this mixture will make about 50 biscuits. So just cut the number that you need and then you can put the rest in the freezer and keep it there until you need it another time. So once you've got the number of sable that you need, just brush their tops with a little egg wash. So this is an egg yolk mixed with about a tablespoon of cold water. And this will just give a really lovely glossy glaze to the top of the biscuits. And then lastly, I've got some caraway seeds. Now these have a fantastic flavour, which works brilliantly with our cheddar. But if you don't have any, you could also try these with poppy seeds or sesame seeds. And then these need to go into a preheated oven at 190 degrees Celsius. That's 375 degrees Fahrenheit or gas mark five for just six to eight minutes. So here are my cheddar and caraway cheese sable biscuits ready to serve with a lovely chilled glass of wine.